The sky was a deep blue, and the sun shined brightly on the small village of Windmill. In the center of the village lived Skybird, a young girl with an insatiable curiosity. She had heard stories of a mysterious place far away, and she was determined to find out what lay beyond the horizon. With a plan in her heart and a sparkle in her eye, Skybird set out on an adventure to uncover the secrets of the unknown. Skybird was a curious creature, always looking for new experiences. He had heard tales of a magical forest full of wonders and was eager to explore it. After much deliberation, he decided to embark on a journey to find this mysterious forest and uncover its secrets. After making a new friend in the forest, I decided to explore further. I was amazed by the variety of creatures I encountered, from small birds flitting between trees to larger mammals grazing in the meadows. I was also surprised by the sheer size of the forest, discovering new areas and hidden pathways as I went. I felt a sense of awe as I walked through the trees, and I knew I had made the right decision to explore this magical place. Skybird was determined to push her limits and face the challenge of exploring the unknown. With a newfound appreciation of the environment around her, she was ready to take on whatever obstacles she would encounter. She set off into the depths of the forest, determined to uncover the secrets behind the mysterious door. After facing the challenge, the animals of the forest began to gather. They all came from different places, but they all shared the same goal, to join together and make the forest a better place. The birds flew in from the sky, the deer ran in from the meadows, and the foxes and wolves came in from the shadows. The squirrels and chipmunks scurried in from the trees, and the raccoons and skunks waddled in from the rivers. All the animals were excited to be part of this special gathering. The energy in the forest was palpable, and the animals were eager to begin. The forest celebration began with a great feast. All the animals gathered around a huge bonfire and shared stories of their adventures. The birds sang and the wolves howled in celebration. After the feast, the animals danced and played games, and the spirits of the forest rejoiced in the joy of the gathering. The celebration lasted until the early hours of the morning, when the animals said their goodbyes and each went their own way, filled with the happiness of the night. Skybird bid farewell to the animals, thanking them for their help and friendship. With a heavy heart, she spread her wings and flew away, leaving the forest and the animals behind most behind. As she flew away, the animals waved goodbye, wishing her a safe journey back home. After the joyous celebration in the forest, Skybird and the other animals began their journey home. The sun was setting, creating a beautiful sky full of oranges and pink setting. The animals chatted and laughed, reminiscing on the day's events. They made their way through the trees, the leaves rustling in the wind as they passed. Soon they reached the edge of the forest, and the animals said their goodbyes to Skybird. She thanked them for their friendship and promised to return soon, soon. With a tear in her eye, she spread her wings and flew away, leaving the animals behind her eye. As they watched her go, they knew they had made a special connection that would never be forgotten.
After much deliberation, Skybird decided that she would embark on a journey to discover the source of the strange noise. She packed her bag with supplies and set off on her adventure. She followed the winding path up the mountain, taking in the sights and sounds of the forest. As she ascended, the trees grew thicker and the air grew colder. Skybird was filled with anticipation as she made her way through the forest, wondering what she would find at the end of her journey. The journey begins, had led the adventurers to a dark and mysterious forest. The trees were tall and imposing, their branches reaching up to the sky like a canopy. The air was thick with the scent of damp moss and decaying leaves. It was a quiet and eerie place, and the adventurers felt a chill as they stepped into the shadows of the trees. Everywhere they looked, they saw strange shapes and shadows, and heard strange noises coming from all directions. The adventurers were both excited and a little scared as they ventured deeper into the forest, unsure of what they would find. find. As Skybird ventured further into the forest, he began to hear a strange and mysterious noise. He couldn't quite make out what it was, but it sounded like a low hum. He stopped and listened carefully, trying to identify the source of the noise, but it seemed to be coming from everywhere. He was both intrigued and a little bit scared, so he decided to keep going and see what he could find. After exploring the strange noise, the group came across a clearing in the forest. In the center of the clearing was a large, mysterious object. As they approached it, they noticed it was a large, ornate door with symbols and markings they had never seen before. With a sense of excitement, they opened the door and stepped inside, ready to discover what secrets were hidden behind it. Skybird was determined to explore the unknown and find the secrets hidden behind the mysterious door. She packed her supplies and set off on her journey, filled with curiosity and excitement. She trudged through the thick forest, the sounds of nature surrounding her, and the shadows of the trees looming overhead. With each step, her courage and determination grew, and she was ready to take on whatever the forest had to offer. After beginning the search for the magical forest, I soon encountered its inhabitants. I was amazed to find a variety of animals living in the forest, from rabbits and foxes to deer and bears. I was even more surprised to find that the animals were friendly and welcoming to me. As I made my way through the forest, I found myself stopping to chat with the animals learning about their lives and their experiences in the forest. I was fascinated by the stories they shared and the knowledge they had, and I was grateful for the opportunity to learn more about the forest and its inhabitants. After meeting the animals, I was eager to learn more about the forest. I asked the animals about the different plants and trees, the different types of soil, and the various types of wildlife that lived in the area. I was amazed by the vast amount of knowledge they had, and the stories they shared. I was even able to identify some of the plants and trees that I had never seen before. I was also able to observe some of the animals in their natural habitat which was an incredible experience. By learning about the forest, I was able to gain a deeper understanding and appreciation of the environment around me. I was walking through the forest, 
when I heard a rustling in the bushes. To my surprise, I saw a small rabbit hopping around. It seemed curious and friendly, so I decided to approach it. As I got closer, the rabbit hopped away, but then stopped and looked back at me. I slowly reached out my hand, and the rabbit hopped onto it. We had an instant connection, and I was so excited to have made a new friend in the forest. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to hit the subscribe button and turn on notifications so you never miss an update from us. We'll be bringing you more exciting stories and videos like this one. See you next time.